Hello, welcome to this Romero Rocks edition of Hillbilly DVD Reviews Unboxing Series. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Twilight Time limited edition release of the Night of the Living Dead remake on Blu-ray. Since our unboxing of the Fright Night Twilight Time limited edition Blu-ray is our most watched uh, video on our channel and brought in a lot of new people. If you happen to be watching the channel for the first time, welcome aboard. Feel free to look around and see all the other bullshit we got. We got movie reviews, we got steelbook unboxings, we got just got silly fucking random horse shit captured on videotape. Take a look around. Shrink up all Twilight Time. They did all original art for the layout and stuff. They picked this picture of a zombie from the movie, which I think is very cool. You know, a lot of people didn't like this cover and stuff. You know, everything Twilight Time does is controversial, but I like the cover art. I like how they did the red tint. Just got a nice fucking basic font on the spine. The back just looks like a regular blur ray. Got the special features listed there, which is isolated score track, audio commentary by Tom Savini, who directed the remake, original theatrical trailer. These actually aren't individually numbered, but it does say limited edition of 3,000 units on the back. Let's open it up. Got a very cool, creepy discard here with the zombie from the cover. I like it a lot. They also include a little booklet, as most Twilight Time releases do. Or all of them, as far as I know. The only thing that's a little weird about this picture is the zombie, he's got Night of the Living Dead <laughs> written on, on his chest. That, that ain't in the movie. I don't know who the fuck came up with that. But that's not in the movie. But uh, somebody had to get creative, I guess. But it's, it's got, you know, I like these little booklets. The only thing I had a beef with the Fright Night one is the little essay, the background of the Fright Night one. It was saying that, um, basically, that the movie was a gay metaphor, which I just don't believe is true, just because the writer and director of the movie ain't gay. just happened to have a gay and a lesbian cast in it but uh, I haven't read this booklet yet so hopefully you know there's some good insight uh, I don't know if she does all of them but this is written by Julie Kurgo I'm not really sure what her credits credentials are but uh, Twilight Time likes her to write this shit about it I think the packaging is really good on this for limited edition release it really pops when it's all on your shelf it kind of pops out you know the black the white the red it all goes together so yeah so that's it for the Twilight Time limited edition Night Living Dead uh, Twilight Time just as a company is always controversial people don't like their business model whatever but hey man like I'm happy to have this fucking movie on Blu-ray um, it's one of my favorite horror movies from the 90's just one of my favorite zombie movies period really so it's cool to have it uh, you know unfortunately the limited edition thing this actually did sell out in the pre-order stage it didn't well they only sell it on the website anyway so it's not like you would ever seen this in a store it went on the pre-orders I think it took like eight or nine days to sell out so you know probably gonna be a lot of people caught with their pants down uh, I almost lost out on the Fright Night one. I'm glad I got a copy right before they sold out. I'm going to be doing a review for this disc in a couple days, so check back on Wednesday, see what I have to say about the actual quality of the disc and all that. So that's it. Twilight Time and I Living Dead. Another limited edition release that we all got to chase around and fucking find and shit before it goes out of print. But hey, that's how it goes as a horror fan. You know it.